All right, chapter four, introduction to satellite communications. Non-resident train course, September 1998, Navy Electricity, Electricity Electronic Training Series, Module 17, Radio Frequency Communication Principles, Distribution Statement, Proof of Public Distribution Unlimited. Chapter four, introduction to satellite communications. Of learning objective of the final equation, you will be able to do um, basic operation of two types of satellites, basic component for the operational satellite system, describe function of the earth or terminal equipment, base, um, describe the basic single flow of the typical shipboard receiving only system to a basic single flow with typical shipboard transceiver system. Describe the advantage of satellite communication in terms of capacity, reliability, vulnerability, flexibility. Describe limitations of satellites in terms of powers, but receiver sensitivity and availability. History of satellite communication. First artificial satellite was placed in the orbit in Russia in 1957. The satellite was named Sputnik. Single the very beginning with the air. The United States was behind the Russian made an all-out effort to catch up launch of the score of the 1958 with the first satellite primary purpose of communications. The figure rig, or the first regular satellite communication service was used in the the moon was used to balance the teletype radar signal with the high of Washington, D.C. During the early 1960s, the Navy the used the moon to medium the passaging um, messages between the ships and shore of the station. The massive the communication provided reliable other messages um, failed. Military satellite communication technology was at a low level until the 1965 timely call. Voice transmitter was where we conducted the satellite to Earth station of the stepping of the zone of the internal initial defense communication satellite program or IDCSP it was covered later in the chapter the experience of the satellite communication demonstrated the satellite can satisfy many of the military requirements of reliable service will secure the cost effective method that kill communication easily satellites are ideal but the often not the only solution to the problem communicating with high mobile forces the satellite is probably able to provide much needed the operation to options to large and fixed ground installations for the past 50 years the Navy has used the high frequency transmission for Principal method the same as in 1970, the high frequency spectrum was overcrowded, and the free frequencies were at a um, premium and high frequency of jamming the electric current image of the techniques and were highly sophisticated during the period. As a result, neither the advanced long range transmission method became apparent. Communication be with this added a natural outgrowth of modern technology with the demand with greater capacity, higher quality communications, and half the various method military branches have the resources to support the communications and even the predicted usable indicators. Large scale improvements will have to be made to satisfy the future need. The Department of Defense this need the greater capacity of the long haul of communications previously inaccessible satellite communications the most promise to satisfy the future requirements. The Defense Communication Satellite Program. The Defense Communication Satellite Program or DCSP with the indicate of the Secretary of Defense for the nineteen sixty two with the phase one program with the given the initial defense. Communication satellite program. First satellite launch recording uh, occurred in nineteen uh, June nineteen sixty six. Seven experimental satellites were placed in order the first launch of the program. The eight satellites occurred in nineteen sixty eight. The defensive satellite communications phase two with the phase two with the defensive satellite communication will have the range for the all along the analog communications for the all digital communications of the performance capability of the phase two the defensive satellite communication system limited the equipment availability and effective intensive the effective the tra tra traffic capability has become a common of the credit, the available the digital mono modems, modulator, demodulator, broadband equipment. The overall performance of the phase two defensive um, satellite communication system greatly improved over the capable of the phase one defensive satellite com um, communication system. The phase two satellites provide a greater increase of effect of the rated power radio frequency band. Whether you have the um, finding satellite configurations, you've the wire covered in the narrow beam, beam antenna to provide the sense of the range of communications over the capability they were further discussed later in this chapter. All right, your fundamental satellite communication system. Satellite communication, you either sit satellite um, satellites or relay radio transmission between Earth and terminal with the two types of communication satellites you will um, study are active and passive. A passive satellite only reflects the ra receive the radio signals back to Earth, and an active satellite acts as a repeater amplifier signal to receive the th um, retransmit the back to Earth. They increase the signal, but the st strength of the receiving terminal at a higher level would be available to passive and from a pa passive satellite. A typical operation involved with a active satellite and two or more other um, Earth terminals. One station transmit with the satellite on the frequency called the uplink frequency, and the satellite amplified with the signal converted to the downlink frequency. Transmit it back to Earth. The signal is next picked up. The receiving terminal figure or one showing the same, um, satellite handling several combinations of the link simultaneously. All right, this shows satellite communication. Show the satellite aircraft command, um, aircraft terminal, fixed terminal, ship terminal, subsurface terminal, um, semi fixed terminal, transporter terminal. All right, description of communication system. The basic um, design of the satellite communication system depends on the great degree of the character of the orbital set of the satellite. In general term, the orbit is either elliptical or circular shape. The system um, type of the orbit is synchronizing orbit. With this, uh, the type of the youth of the period of time occurred one revolution over the orbit in space that the Earth the orbit of the non-synchronizing is called the asynchronous. 
Any synchronous and period with the orbit that approaches the Earth is called the near synchronous and subsynchronous orbits. We'll discuss them more detail later in the chapter. The additional fundamental component of the figure four one is designed with the overall system to determine the components. See the various components of the manner in which the system operates with the carrier and current satellite with the carrying uh, capable of handling many teletype radio voice car- current circuits at the same in time. Orbit descriptions. Uh, other orbits generally orbits generally described according to the physical shape and the orbit angle with the inclination of plane, plane of the orbit the terms uh, are discussed in the following paragraphs. Physical shape of the system. Uh, satellites orbit to the Earth are a elliptical orbit of the circle is a special case of the ellipse of the ship, uh, shape of the orbit is determined the initial launch parameters later deployment of the techniques used the per- pergy and the OPOG are two three um, parameters to describe the orbit Orbital data satellite there shown figure four two purge is the point of the orbital nearest the center of the earth at Pogy is the point of the orbital greatest distance for the center of the earth both distance are about the nautical miles. Should the orbit in thirty degrees equator and sixty degree angle um, indicates the overall area of the which the satellite passes. This is uh, angle and inclination, angle and, uh, angle between the equa- equator uh, equator of the plane of the earth orbital plane of the satellite third parameter you have described the orbit of the plane day of the satellite. Figure four three depicts the angle and inclination between the equilateral plane and the orbital plane. The most satellites of the Earth are orbital plane do not coincide with the electrical plane of the Earth. The satellite orbiting the plane not the equilateral plane is the inclined orbit. To the North Pole or um, Earth an angle of inclination equatorial plane satellite motion. South inclination of the orbit is determined by the area covered by the path of the satellite. As shown in Figure 44, the greater inclination or the greater amount of the surfaces are covered by the satellite. So the orbital um, indicate the area over which the satellite path. The, um, the special types of inclined orbits. Uh, satellite orbiting in the plane of the side of the equilateral plane over the Earth of the equilateral orbit. Satellite, satellite orbit. Orbiting in an inclined orbit with the angle of the inclination 90 degrees or 90 degrees of the polar orbit. The special court circular orbits have been stated that previously a circular orbit is a slip. Special type of elliptical orbit. You should realize that circular orbit is one of the major, minor axes. Major and minor axes of the distance equal to the approximate equal to the many, many of the mean the height of the above the or the instead of the perigee and apogee. But if you describe circular motion, the uh, circular orbit. We are discussing circular orbits. You should look at some of the terms mentioned earlier in the steps of satellite. When the circular orbit is high, approximately 19,300 nautical miles above the Earth and synchronized orbit at altitude of the period of rotation over the satellite is 24 hours. The same rotation period over the Earth and otherwise the orbit over the satellite is synch- synced with the rotational motion over the Earth. Although inclined polar synchronizing orbits are post possible term synchronizing ref- refers to synchronizing or, or equatorial orbit, the type of the orbit if satellite appears with the how over the motionless and the sky figure 4 or 5 shows the how one of these satellites can provide co- coverage to almost half of the surface of the Earth. Luminous and synchronizing satellite. Four, five, three satellites can be revived with cover to om- over most of the Earth except for the satellite extreme north and southern pole regions. The polar projection of the global coverage of three satellites are shown in figure four or six. Worldwide synchronizing satellite view with the, above the North Pole. Satellite circuit orbit over the other is um, at, uh, at other than 19,300 nautical miles above the Earth is near Synchronizing orbit that orbit is lower than 19,300 nautical miles. The period of orbit of the satellite is less than the period of the orbit of the Earth satellite. Then appears to move slowly around the Earth from west to the east. Um, the typical this type of the orbit is called the subsynchronizing. That if the orbit is higher than 19,300 miles nautical miles, the period of orbit of the satellite is greater than the period of the orbit of the Earth. The satellite then appears to move moving slowly around the Earth from east to west in the inclined polar near synchronizing orbit possible, and the near synchronizing um, implies equal orbit. Equatorial orbit. Um, the satellite circular orbit, approximately 2,000 to 12,000 miles above the Earth, is considered to be a medium altitude orbit. The period of the medium altitude satellite is considerably less than that of the Earth. But when you look at the altitude satellite, it appears to move rather quickly across the sky from east to west. Satellite characteristics: early communication satellites were limited inside of the diameter of the final stage of the rocket. They were used to launch. Weight is determined in thrust of the rocket motors and maximum weight of the rocket could lift into orbit. As early as June 1962, satellites successfully placed in orbit in the same launch vehicle that developed the multi-launch capability. The added flexibility became available when they had the short to decide the weight and number of satellites to be included in each launch. Using a multi-launch capability, defensive satellite communication system has placed larger, heavier satellites in synchronizing equilateral equatorial orbit. Figure 4 7 is drawn into the Defensive satellite communication system satellite is shown each of the pair with the transmitters receiving the dish antennas. As you can see, the large area of the Earth can be covered by using only one satellite. Or showing the receiving antenna, the transmitting antenna, satellite power sources, early communication satellites, severely limited to lack of the suitable power source for the severely 
the output, uh, output power satellite transmitter, the only ship with the power, power available within the earlier weight is restricted to very insufficient panel or solar cells with a backup battery backup. A major disadvantage of the type of the power source is that the cell satellite has no power with the ellipse, and when it's ellipsable, is not in the view of some of the four continuous communication. The outage is unacceptable. A combination of solar cells and storage batteries and better prime power source of the practical choice, that even though the result is far from the ideal power source, the top 10% of the energy sunlight that strikes solar cells is converted into electrical power. This lowers the rate, the rate of the sometimes accrued that even the further you find that the solar cells are bombarded by high energy particles they are sometimes found in space. Early in satellites had over um, 8,500 um, solar cells mounted on the surface of the satellite which supplied 42 watts of power, no battery backup with the providing new satellites. Never can, new, newer communications satellites have 32,000 solar cells mounted on the surface of the satellite. They supply about 520 watts. Nickel cadmium batteries use the battery Back up the power during eclipses. Um, nuclear power sources have been used special uh, in space for a special purpose, but they're, they're used to stop. Therefore, technology has not progressed sufficiently for the nuclear power source to be used as a power source. Our satellite orientation. Satellite orientation is based on the important continuous solar cell of the antenna orientation. Since the primary source of the power of the most satellites is the solar cell of the maximum but the solar cells must be exposed to the sun at all times. Satellite antenna must be at a point with the appropriate earth terminal to other communication satellites with the term spin and the stabilization meet these important requirements. Stabilize, spin stabilization operates the principle of the direction of the spin axis with the rotating body tends to remain fixed in the space. The example of the spin stabilization effect of the rotation of the earth keeping of the axis fixed space. Satellite has a spin axle par parallel to the axis of the Earth, which will maintain this position six over the both, since both axes are fixed in the space. The figure four illustrates the use of the principle that depicts an equal equatorial orbit satellite. You would keep the donut shape antenna pattern um, pointing toward the Earth. And show the fixed star field of the Earth, the antenna portion satellite spins fixed star field. Once the satellite is in motion, the spin stabil um, stabilization requires virtually no additional energy. The Spin stabilized satellites usually constructed like a flywheel. Heavier equipment is mounted within the same plane with the cloak of the outside of the surface as possible. After reaching its orbit, radial jets are pulled to the start of the satellite. Spinning spin the satellite spins to access the orientation of the axis of the other means of the small axle jets. Velocity joint jets are used to play with the satellite in orbit position, provide velocity correction. Figure 4 9 is an example of spin stabilization. If you spin axis, antenna, axle jet, radial jets, velocity jets, antenna, axle jet. All right, solar cells are installed around the outside of the, of the surface. It's been stabilized satellite, but that gives you the large number of the solar cells exposed to the sun at all times, except for when the satellite is in clip. The use of the omnidirectional antennas cover a small part of the total radiated energy directly toward the energy at all times, Earth at all times. Omnidirectional antennas radiate and only a small amount of the energy toward the Earth. Many techniques have been tried to achieve the each Earth oriented orientated antenna system. One System developed you the spin stabilization orientation of the satellite. You the standard, standard inner platform for the mounting remote control antenna. The satellite is constructed with the two parts of the bolt that having radio jets. The inner platform contained with the communication antenna. The communication packets after the satellite is stabilized in space. And the radial jet for the spin inner platform. The inner platform is stationary with respect to the earth. Earth is oriented to such a position with the communication antenna points continue with the door of the earth. The arrangement of the also you the high gain direction and antenna with the correction concentrated the majority of the radiated the energy in the direction of the earth. The latest version of the communication satellites with a stationary platform with a, for, high, for high gain antenna with two set steer, steer, steerable narrow, narrow beam antennas are the communication between the width and reason high traffic density. Two heroin antennas provide either earth communication with the green facilities outside of the narrow beam coverage. Antenna arrangement with the types of communication satellites is shown for four seven. Earth char terminal characteristics communication satellite earth terminals are usually located with the Area of the remote they from actual user of the each communication this is necessary to remain by the radio frequency interference with the to the satellite locating with the terminals of the remote locations require the interconnection communication links which permit connections through the flow of the to and from the user of the satellite system and interconnect links are usually connected to be with the telephone cable with the microwave radio links with normal terminal equipment each of the earth satellite communication terminal generally have a single large antenna highly sensitive to receive the power transporter multiplex equipment modulating demodulating equipment and telemetry equipment that each of these elements will be discussed later in this chapter antennas earthly to earth terminal antennas are highly directional high gain antennas capable of the transmitting and receiving the signal simultaneously generally large high gain parabolic antennas are used generally speaking with the three side of the parabolic antennas are currently either the either terminals earth terminal sites or parabolic antenna is 60 feet in the diameter parabolic antenna 40 feet in the 
diameter in a cluster of four parametric bull antennas, parabolic, parabolic antennas that either the 10, 10 feet in diameter of the four in the combination are equal parabolic antenna of the 18 feet in diameter. They are shown in figure 4, 10, 4, 11, and 4, 4 12 respectively. 410 show the typical satellite either ter uh, earth terminal with a 60 foot um, foot antenna show the uh, 40 foot antenna with an pedestal and then shows your para parabolic antenna cluster receivers all satellite communication earth earth terminals are equipped with a special design highly sensitive the receiver the receiver is designed to overcome the downlink of the power loss of the permanent extraction of the desired communication information with the weak receive signal terminals current current and use of the specially designed preamplifiers mounted directly behind the antennas Transmitter. All other transmitters generally high power signals and with transmission communication satellites, high power transmitters, high to the directional high chain antennas are combined in the configuration necessary to overcome the uplink of the limitations to ensure the signal received by the satellite is strong enough to de 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 detected by the satellite. Each transmitter has excited modulator power amplified modulator accepts the input signal with the terminal equipment and the modulates the intermediate frequency of the exciter and translate the intermediate frequency signal the uplink frequency amplifies it to the level required for the power amplifier. The transmitter due to the earth terminals have the hour power capability varies from 10 watts to 20 kilowatts depending on the type of the use and the operational equipment. The telemetry equipment, the telemetry equipment is used to include all communications satellite system with the permits monitoring of the operating conditions within the satellite. Telemetry can be used to use the remote control satellite operations such as energizing axle jets, changing the spin axis of the satellite. All right, spin, shipboard receiving only equipment, um, only re shipboard receiving only equipment system. The so the shipboard receiving only system the receiver of the fleet multi channel teletype radio broadcast that you recall with the chapter one receive no receiver therefore to transmit from the ground station relayed to the naval ships by satellite. From figure four three thirteen typical shipboard receive only system the system the transmitter carrier may be the frequency modulated phase shift key modulated with the type the teletype radio operation receive the antenna for the ship their position with about the ship they arrange in the manner and only and only one at each of the quadrant of the ship the no type there are no type of allow with the line of sight to be blocked between the relay satellite with one more of the antennas and coming signal pass through the antenna to amplifier converter. Each amplifier converter is routed the intermediate frequency signal with a one line on the twin axle cable that connects it into the combiner um, combiner demodulator operating power with the local oscillator signal are coupled with the combiner demodulator to each of the amplifier converter the other line of the cable to the intermediate frequency signal because of the signal path of the variation changing the reflection of the incoming signal they are subject to the random phase of the amplitude variation the combination of operation performed with the combined day modulator remove the phase variation for each input signal evidence measures of the amplitude of the signal optimum combining some of the signal after being combined the signal is demodulated coupled from a receiver the transformer switchboard with a telegraphic demultiplex de terminal Right, this shows your uh, typical shipboard receiving system only. You have your antennas on the outside, then you have a uh, amplifiers, um, converters, and the combined demodulator to the modems, the de de multiplexer. Um, uh, satellite acquisition and tracking. And essential operation for the communication by satellite acquisition locating by the the system or terminal and intent with the subsequent tracking of the satellite in initial acquisition depends upon the exact knowledge of the position of the satellite combined with the geographical location of the Earth. Terminal knowing the position of the satellite enables you to compare with the accurate antenna pointing of the information. The degree of the difficulty locating tracking of the satellite is determined by largely by what type of the orbit the satellite is in. Locating and tracking and synchronizing the satellite is relatively simple because the satellite is appear with the be station or locally near synchronizing satellite is all relatively simple because of the slow relatively motion of the satellite have the mo movement of the near synchronizing satellite is enough to accurately track the um its record to keep the narrow beam antenna pointed toward the satellite. Satellites in the medium altitude circular uh, orbits electrical orbits are more difficult to acquire to track because of the rapid change in position. All right, your orbital prediction. Uh, prediction. Um, to acquire, acquire the track of the satellite in space, the Earth terminal for the antennas must be provided with a very accurate pin and pointing information. Antenna pointing information is based on the orbital prediction of the satellite. The information is derived the inferior table of the table to provide the coordinates of the satellite. So the less old body in the specific time during the given period. After you know the inferior old data of the satellite, you can predict that any of the given location of the parent track of the satellite is viewed from the location of the constant. Finding orbit initially obtained with the processing of the tracking the time of the launch of the rocket to track the radio from the lift alpha of the orbit until the pass over the offside of the tracking data obtained with the Y. This way is sufficient for making the to rough predictions of the orbit. These predictions are more rapidly with the computer sent tracking the stations all over the world. These oh the other tracking stations watch the satellite during the first trip. According to additional data during the first week of the orbiting tracking stations all around the world are obtaining progressively more accurate data concerning the satellite. The data is, in, is put into the computer where the corrections are earlier estimates of the orbit are
were made once the initial predictions are complete with the satellite link become the operational very little change this as calculations are made the orbital satellite will change slightly over the period of time however these changes are so gradual prediction that accurate enough to be used for weeks or even months without further correction when they orbit it is known as precisely the inferiors can be calculated for each of the satellite of the um, system. Antenna pointing. Antenna pointing instruction. Each of the satellite must be computed separately for each of the ground stations. Location satellite bears do the south of the station A. The evaluation of 25 degrees most simultaneous bear do the southeast B. Station at elevation of 30 degrees. The antenna pointing instructions are determined to take into consideration orbital prediction latitude longitude each of the ground station. To establish radio contact with the satellite, the ground station needs to know the bearing and elevation of the satellite. This allows the antenna to be properly pointed. Acquisition of the satellite signal of the ground system um, station equipped with the large antennas operated with the microwave frequency play for the severe requirements of the system. Several factors must be considered. These factors are discussed below. Um, spatial time factor. Um, very accurate antenna pointing information is available to the Earth the terminal satellite control facility located in Sunnyvale, California. Sunnyvale, California. Because of the equipment limitation, small search for the above, um, about periodic location of the satellite must often conduct to make the initial contact with each of the main automatic scan is made around with a small area with close to the point where the satellite appearance is predictable and predicted. Frequency control. Frequency of the radio signal received with the satellite is not generally the exact design. The downlink frequency of the variance or variation depends on the type of the orbit of the satellite. But the greatest frequency variation of the signal of the satellite occurs with the medium altitude circular with the elliptical orbit of the small frequency variation that occurs with the signal and instead of the lights in the night near synchronizing and synchronizing orbit. The tracking. When particular satellite has a required the Earth's terminal actuation, the track, uh, track of the satellite for as long as it was uh, used the communication relay server, several methods of tracking are actually used. However, we will explain with the program tracking, automatic tracking. Program tracking is the, the known the orbital uh, is the known orbital parameters of the satellite fed into the communication equipment that generate the antenna pointing the angles. The antenna pointing angle of the fed with the command with the antenna position servo mechanism. You want to review the servo, uh, servos in each module 15 principal single rows, synchros, and gyros. This point, the antenna in the required direction of the mount of the data is communication, communications involved with the UV, the program traction, and then ostensibly they result of the antenna mounting play, flexing atmospheric and atmospheric bending of the radio waves because of the uncertainty of the program tracking is not used extensively. Automatic tracking is the equipment to generate the antenna point of the information comparing with the direction of the antenna act the direction with which the actual satellite is received. signals received. The automatic tracking system tra is tracking the apparent of the position of the satellite, direction of the arrival of the radial signal, real position of the satellite is not required. The automatic tracking system is the servo mechanism to move the antenna once the satellite has been located. The servo mechanism generates its own pointing data and limits for the requirement of the continuous data the input computation. All right. Um, satellite outage time. The satellite outage time specifications allow for the showing of the uh, um, moving the earth terminal uh, uh, antennas requirement. The satellite signal the checking the circuitry of the continuing hand over the hand over the period of the time over the one earth terminal with the deal with the control of the other with the satellite moving the out of the air over the cover of the hand over the period that prevents presents represents an outage time. If the control if the control terminal is unable to handle handle or hand over the t another terminal with a specified time the other arrangements are made with for example the controls may be retained transformed to another terminal with the over average coverage area the error several reasons the terminal may be unable to assume the control on time their reasons may be combined with the, the average time of the difference for the the drift velocity of the satellites lead to bunching within a covered area. This cover the pa gaps with the coverage and crew the outage time of the two or more satellites simultaneously occupy the same space with the terminal air antennas. They will interfere with each other. This prevents a reliable communication of other factors leading to increase the outage of time satellite sun in conjunction. Increase noise while the satellite passes near the sun or satellite um, eclipse. The absence of power for the solar cell of the satellite failure. The distribution of the outage times are computed and complicated function of the time the earth station and location with a careful coverage co coordination and maximum communication ethics effects is obtained all right roles of satellite and communication in contact with the worldwide military communication network with the satellite communication system is a very important satellite communication link and add up capacity existing communication capability to provide additional and alternating routes of the communication traffic the satellite links and also one over over several long distance links, um, the interconnecting switching center that they located are strategically around the world. They're part of the defensive communication system network. One important aspect of the satellite communication network is the continuous operation over the conditions sometimes rendered other than most of the combination. Communication is inoperable because of, the, um, of this satellite may be the significant contribution and improve the reliability of Navy communications. Advantage of the satellite communication. Satellite communications have a unique advantage over conventional long distance tra transmission. The satellite links are unaffected with the by propagation variation, interfering with the high frequency radio. For, uh, they are also free from the actuation of the wire cable facilities. They are capable of spanning long distances 
of the numerous repeater station that required the line of sight of the tra 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 tropo scatter links of the no longer needed. They are further really re further they furnish reliability flexibility for the, the need of the support of the military operation capacity. Of the the present military communication satellite system is capable of the communications between the back um, backpack airborne shipboard terminal system capable of the handling thousands of the communication channels reliability communication satellite frequency but not dependent upon reflection refraction and or effect on satellite slightly by atmospheric phenomena the reliability satellite communication system is limited only to equipment of reliability and skill of the operational maintenance of personnel vulnerability Destruction of an orbiting vehicle with any of the as possible, however, the destruction of a single communication satellite would be quite difficult and expensive. The cost would be expensively compared to tactical advantage in game, but it would be particularly difficult to destroy an entire multiple satellite system with 26 random uh, output orbital satellite system currently in use. The Earth, Earth term, terminals offer and more attractive target, but the physical destruction they can also be protected by the same measure that are taken and protected by the other vital installations. High degree of freedom of the damage damage over this provided by the high directional antennas out of the earth terminal of the wideband um, system of this acumen accommodated the sophisticated anti-jamming modulation techniques also less in vulnerability um flexibility mo most operable operational military satellite earth terminals are housed in the transport transportable vans these can be loaded with the cargo plane with the flown into remote areas which are train crew the terminals can be put into operation in a matter of hours worldwide communication can be established quite quickly to remote areas nearly anywhere in the free world all right, sim, 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 satellite limitations. Limitation of the satellite communications are determined by the technical characteristics of the satellite. It's orbital parameters. Active communication satellite systems are limited to two things. Satellite transmitter power on the downlinks and receiver the sensitivity on the uplinks. Some earlier communication satellites have limited low gain antennas power. The amount of the power available to the active of the satellite with limited weight can restriction, restriction both of the satellite earlier communication satellites were limited to a few hundred pounds because of the launching vehicle payload restraint the only feasible power source with an inefficient solar cell with the total power generated with the earlier satellites was less than 50 watts as you can see with the radio frequency power output severely and was limited therefore the relatively weak signal is transmitted by the satellite on the downlink this weak, um, weak transmitted signal is often reduced by the propagation law with the result of very weak link in its beginning being available to Earth terminal the level of si signals received from the satellite comparable to a combination of external atmospheric noise and internal noise of the standard receiver. The special techniques must be to extract the desired information from the received signal. Large high gain antenna special types of the preamplifier solve the problem, but adding complexity and size to the Earth terminal, the smallest terminal of the defense communication system network has an effective 18 foot antenna and weight. 19,500 pounds. Development of the more efficient power sources of relaxation and weight restriction has been permitted to improve satellite performance and increase speed capacity. Our receiver sensitivity power transmitted by the highly directional antennas are even the earth safety even when the larger transmitter with the long signals lost is across the satellite. The satellite antenna received only a small amount of the transmitted signal power with respect to the weak signal is received the satellite receiver this presents a little problem with the strength of the signal to receive on the uplink but not as critical as the received on the downlink um, the downlink signal is critical but the cover the signal transmitted from the satellite is very low in power to develop the high gain antenna the highly sensitive the receivers have to help to solve the downlink problem all right, your availability. Availability of the satellite to act relay of the station between the two Earth terminals depends on the location of the Earth terminal of the orbit of the satellite. All satellites expect with a synchronizing orbit of the view and the aim of the given power of the pair of the Earth station only part of the time and the length of the time of the non synchronizing satellite circle orbit within zone of mutual visibility. So that it can be seen from both terminals depending on the height of the which for the satellite is a circling elliptical orbit to cover the satellite zone of the mutual, mutual visibility between any two earth terminal for the very with the orbit to orbit it these two times the multiple mutual visibility or predictable figure 414 illustrates the zone of mutual visibility all right so the zone of mutual visibility station one station two um the and uh future satellite communications satellite communications are becoming well established in the navy and October 1983, the Department of the Navy itself with the Navy Space Command, which assumed the operation of the response of the Navy the Space um, System, plus the coordinated with the responsibility of the operational activity of most ships that have the satellite communications capability. The new system have been installed on the ships that are full capability with the electronic system. The of the communication view of the satellite has improved the access existing Navy the communication capability of the command and control of the naval forces. Satellite communications have not replaced all existing mains of the radio communication, but however, it's a major step of the modern Navy communication to relieve Navy of its old dependency of the high, radio, high frequency radio transmission reduced in the of the, many of the high frequency ground station overseas. A recent step in the advancement of the satellite communication started with the defense, um, DSS, defense, um, DSS, um, Phase three, phase, phase, phase three satellite was launched into orbit of the space shuttle over the summer of 1984. Some of the satellites 
for play within space during this phase. Figure 415 shows the phase 3 satellite being tested in simulated space environment. Figure 416 shows the phase 3 satellite and it appears in space. Phase 3 will develop at least the with, um, develop the use of 41 solid state amplifiers to play for the current using traveling wave tube, um, which was also the develop the new type of filters. The filters will provide increased channel the bandwidth will provide additional communication capacity. Uh, this shows your uh, DCS federal, um, phase 3 satellite phase 3 satellite as it appears in space. Uh, this variability of reliable communication with the command control with the our strategic nuclear force and paramount space system and performance of any of the mission the more effectively earthbound systems. Space foreign communication group the effect of the military operation the Department of Defense gave the development of the new communication technique system including some of the, of the space on the uh, space base. You have the space continuous from the uh, march from, um, forward with the visual and the New opportunity the national defense will continue to materialize will improve the survivability of strategic communication given the nuclear and electronic attack. Uh, more information satellite communication can be found with the Navy the um, Navy satellite operation. The publication of written and concise that explain the role of the Navy in the defense communication satellite program and also issue the procedure effect the coordinated use of the satellite resources. Chapter 4 Summary.